we've got this Russian tie. Okay, so I'm in here, I've got that shoulder above his shoulder, and I'm in this position. So the first thing that we've got from this position is kind of a shuck. Okay, so what I'm going to use is I'm going to use my bicep to kind of push him forward a little bit. Okay, I have to have the uh, posture broken down. Okay, if he's up in this position, he's probably got more chance of getting away, but this is where we could use it for striking. Okay, so posture down into here. Yeah. I'm going to shuck him and then I'm going to come round with this hand and try and grab his hip. So, forward, to take his back, or her back. Okay, so, go through the full thing. So, here, make sure that this arm's nice and high, we hit the bump, rock and posture, straight into a Russian tie. Yeah, we can also start grabbing the legs if we want, but I always find with the shuck it's easier to come round and grab the hip. Okay, so we're just going to move him into the front. It's not a massive, movement so when i'm doing it it's just a little bump so it's similar to the first shoulder bump okay so it's like a gangster gangster kind of dance we don't dance with boogie okay so it's just there we can start looking to attack the legs as well okay as long as they're moving and they take that step forward that's the key because from that position it also opens up some opportunities to strike so his hand goes across into here but that posture yeah, I can use that short to then start setting up kicks and stuff. Because they're in a position where they're, they're not able to attack you. That's when you can start throwing some big power kicks. Okay, so have a little play with a few different things. If you are kicking, don't blast them in the face. It's too early. Huh? What was that? I'm making sure she's in. Alright.